two. And we are ready. Okay, the good news, as you know, is this panel is slotted, and uh, the evidence does indicate that it's rubbing on the edge here on the slats, but in order to slide this panel over, um, we would need to remove this closeout uh, filler panel right here because this is keeping the panel from sliding far enough away from the uh, slats to uh, allow it to stop rubbing on the uh, aluminum closeout panel. We we're wondering if we could remove this panel, and that basically uh, just fills this hole on the top of the panel. If we could maybe just take this closeout off and just cover the hole with some Kapton tape. We're checking. Otherwise, it's going to end up in the exact same position, and uh, there's, there's a bit of an overlap, uh, a couple of millimeters over the side of the slat. That's not true on the other side. The opposite side closeout panel, I can see a gap between of about uh, one and a half millimeters between that closeout panel and the edge of the slats. And we copy that's good data. Thank you. Andrew, we like that idea. Uh, so you can go ahead and take that filler panel off. Instead of Kapton tape, we're going to have you use some Nomex covers, and we're looking for those locations now, but you can get started on taking off the filler panel. <laughs> 